Hi guys and happy Wednesday, it is Vlogmas Day 14. I'm not very good at remembering what day it was, or is. Won't let this moment pass us by. Jen has managed to spend the entire day at work. I dropped her off this morning to save her the walk in and I've been kind of like anticipating a call all day but there has been nothing which is good. She said she's been a bit tired but apart from that she's managed the day so thumbs up for Jen. It seems like we're getting there. I'm gonna go and pick her up now. I'm gonna take today's box because we need to go and get a gingerbread house if they've got any left. Um, and maybe there's another task in here. God, I hope there isn't. But at least if we do it before we go to the shop, we're prepared if we need to go to the shop for anything. We are probably just gonna go and look at some baby clothes because now we know whether we're having a boy or a girl. We do, we're not telling you just yet, but now we know we get to actually look at a particular gender's clothes and not have to sort of like get a heart set on one particular type or another or one particular item of clothing or another just to not be able to buy it because it won't, well, I suppose it would fit but it might be a bit odd pushing your baby around in the opposite sex's clothes. It'd make for some interesting conversations, wouldn't it, while you're out for a walk. Oh, what a lovely baby girl, what a lovely baby boy. No, it's not. Like, look on people's face. We should just do that anyway. So, Pip, if you're watching this in the future and we've pushed you around in the opposite sex clothes, sorry. Shoes on, go and find Jen and hopefully she can stay awake long enough. She was a bit hesitant to go at first, but when I said that she could sleep on the car, in the car on the way there and on the way back, and she doesn't have to come out of the car for the most part, she seemed quite happy. Christmas music will definitely make Jen super happy. Better do. Picked her up. She's still alive, I promise. See? Eyes are open. Breathing. For now, eyes are open. I quite want to be asleep. <laughs> yeah, yeah. You have to apologise. I Sorry, I have to apologise for the ridiculous camera angle. This cannot be flattering for either of us. But she can't hold you. I can't hold you because I'm driving. So you're going to have to stay there. Jen, I brought this at the house for you. Is that in shot? Yeah, yeah, that's it. Okay. And today's hey. advent calendar. You've still got loads of yours to do when you go home. I do. I haven't done them. Oh, that one. Okay, great. Right. Oh, FYI, there's at least one task in there. Oh, I'm so tired. <laughs> oh, tough shit. You, we knew this was coming. You decided we you didn't did. want to do it yesterday, so we've got to do it today. Yes. If we can buy the damn gingerbread house on us. Well, we don't know what's inside it yet. We do. We it was yesterday. We it. put it in. Okay, we have two chocolates. Yay. What chocolates? Just stickers and a galaxy caramel. Okay. We've had a lot of caramels. We have. We'll do that later. Okay. Tasks. Oh, there's two tasks. <laughs> right, we have decorated gingerbread house. Brilliant. Again! What is bride? How many times have we had this one? Too Just many twice. times, I can't remember. Too many times. Hopefully we can try and buy a gingerbread house or all the parts to make a gingerbread house while we're out. Second task is watch a new Christmas movie. That we can maybe do. No, we've already done it. We can put it on. Krampus. We saw it already. That counts, right? That doesn't count. We already did it. We need to do it now. We should have saved Krampus for today. We didn't know it was going to be in today. Even though I put it in, I didn't know it was going to be in today. But at least, if I put a Christmas movie on, you can fall asleep really early if you're not feeling too well. Yeah, that's not good. That's a good task for Jen to do without doing. We decided to be a little bit naughty. We are both starving and we've got a busy night ahead. So I don't think you can understand a word you're saying. Really? And maybe they can. They better had to. I'm trying my best. We have accidentally pulled into the McDonald's drive-thru. You say accidentally. Oops. It, it was a calculated decision on your part. It was. It sounds really good. It's like salty and greasy and maybe not so greasy. That doesn't sound so good. Something it's high like calorie stodgy. with a lot of energy in it. Yeah, That's I the need good bit. energy. Energy's a good bit. Look what I found for you. Question is, will you still be awake when we get home to do it? Um, I'll try. How about that? We're currently in Matalan, and I was wondering why they're selling Rudolph's head, but it turns out it's supposed to be a moose. But it was pretty creepy. Certainly not very child friendly. While we were out, my mum called, practically begging me to tell her the sex of our new baby to be. Shep knows, we've told Shep. But he's not going to tell anyone. That's the best bit of dogs. You can tell them anything and they won't tell anybody. So yeah, you're not the only one we're not telling. We're not telling anybody, at least not yet. Not for a little while. It's our secret to keep and our secret to share. Soon. 
soon. Oh yeah, while we're out, um, we also bought, where is it? Where is it? We bought this, but Jen said, I can't, stupid dog. I can't show you because it might give the game away. So, it's not yours. So instead, I'm gonna show you the back of it. Because I wanted to show you, and I figured I'm gonna show you anyway. You're just not allowed to know what the front says, just in case you figure out whether I'm a boy or a girl. Do you know? I know. I know. I was there. Shit knows. It must be torture for people wanting to know. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry guys. It's like to have news, but it's to us. <laughs> and nobody else knows. There's not many opportunities in life. I'm happy. The question is, do we tell people before the birth or wait until the birth? What do you guys think? Should we tell you now? Should we tell you soon? Or should we tell you when he, she arrives? Comment down below guys, let me know what you think. I can't promise anything, but what do you think we should do? Although we finally managed to pick up one of these gingerbread house things, unfortunately, Jen, I don't think is gonna be able to stay awake for the next 20 minutes let alone longer to put it off. So we're gonna to have to put it off again, but at least we have it. And I'm gonna put it under the TV so it reminds us yes. to make sure we actually get it done. And we can enjoy doing it tomorrow. You say tomorrow, but you said tomorrow today and yesterday and stuff. We did get a couple of cards today. Yes, Christmas cards. Yeah, let's get this. Yeah, you can probably hear her now. She's actually talking yeah, I have more than a whisper. <laughs> Just a bit croaky. Look at all the Christmas cards we've got. They are building up quite a collection. We have cards from Adam and Laura, from Chris's dad and Julie, from Dave and Katie, from my auntie Irene, and from our neighbours Lou and Debbie and their little dog. It's a huge collection of cards. They're just the ones that came today and yesterday. I don't think we normally get like this many cards in total. Well, alone in two days. That's pretty cool. We really need to start sending out our cards because we haven't written any this year. And now it looks like we're going to have to because we're receiving cards. We need to get on it. Christmas is really soon. Christmas is like... 10 days away and it's getting in the way it of is. us having a baby no but the sooner christmas is done the sooner we're gonna have a baby is that like the next event i don't know this camera's getting really heavy oh <sighs> oh we should watch our film okay what are we gonna watch i don't know yet but you best put the camera i down. need to put the camera down so it's the next day and i'm currently editing yesterday's vlog and it turns out we didn't end it because well we were both pretty tired so we didn't do the gingerbread house. If Jen is awake enough when she comes home from work, we can do that. Um, we did watch a movie. Jen started watching uh, the um, Polar Express a couple of days ago, but she never got around to finish watching it. And because she was wrapping presents while she was doing it, she didn't really get to watch it, watch it. I've never seen it before. It was the first time she was watching it. And Dev had suggested that it was a really good film. So I figured, why don't we watch that? Um, because it was on Netflix, I think it was Netflix, something like that, it means that we didn't have to pay for it. So when Jen fell asleep and I fell asleep, it didn't really matter. We fell asleep, it was tired, uh, sorry, it was tired, I was tired, and I completely forgot to end the vlog. So this is me ending the vlog for today. I'll see you tomorrow, which is today. Anyway, thanks for watching. Thumbs up, comments down below, and I will see you guys now. We found out the sex 